Oh my god. What's up for? Bro, I didn't even go and play it. I fucking I'm just sitting here it's dead silence. Oh I was, man. I was wondering like what the fuck. <laughs> well, well, we're live, so if anybody is tuned in, yeah, we're just sitting here with dead silence. Let 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 me wow. uh try this shit again. Only on Underground Wicked Radio, man. I always make fucking stupid mistakes. I swear to God. All right. Let's try this again. The intro. Probably would have helped if I'd have pulled it up. All right, here we go. May I have your queen's attention, please? I have your queen's attention, please? Stand up. 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 We're gonna have a cup of tea here. Y'all act like you've never seen a UK in person before. Jaws all on the floor, like jam on the floor. Like Elizabeth the second just burst in the door and started pooping her cover. Well, that's worse than the four. They first were as if Prince Philip throwing up over furniture. It's the return of the R way. No way, you're kidding. He didn't just say what I think he did, did he? And Prince Philip said, Nothing, you idiots. Prince Philip, he locked in my casket. Ah, feminist women love UK insanes. United Kingdom, I'm sick of him. Look at him walking around, grabbing his you know what, flipping the Liberal Democrats. You know who? Yeah, but he's so though. Yeah, I probably got a couple of tea bags up in my head loose, but no worse than what's going on in your parents' bedroom. Sometimes I want to get on TV and just let loose. I can't, but it's cool for Tom Green to hop a dead moose. My bum is on your queen's lips, my bum is on your queen's lip. And if I'm lucky, you might just give her her little kiss. And that's the message that we deliver to UK kids and expect them not to know what a woman's more broadly is of course they're gonna know what tally walker is by the time they hit fourth grade they got the discovery channel don't they well some of us body cannibal who cut other people open like cantaloupes but if we can hump dead animals and chin wags then there's no reason that a bloke at another lad cantaloupe but if you feel like I feel, I got the antidote. Women with your pantyhose, sing the chorus, let it go. I'm UKing, yes, I'm the real United. All you other bloke or lads are just imitating. So won't the real UK please stand up, please stand up, please stand up. Will Smith don't got a cuss in his rap to sell his records, what I do. So fuck him and fuck you too. You think I give a damn about a United Kingdom? Half of you critics can't even stomach the queen, let alone stand King Henry. With UK, what if you win? Wouldn't it be weird? Why? So you guys can just lie to get me more tears. How many tea bags and brassiers so you can sit me here next to the queen? Tit turns on shit. Clown deadhead hunter better switch me chairs so I can sit next to Carson Daly and Fred Durst and hear him argue over who she gave the queen head to first. You little bitch, put me on blast on MTV. Yeah, he's cute. I think he's married to Queen Lover <laughs> Victory. I should download her audio on MP3 and show the whole world how you gave UK VD. I'm sick of you, little girl and boy groups. All you do is annoy me. So I have been sent here to destroy you. And there's a million of UK just like me who cuss like me who just. You must. And we're alive on Underground Wicked Radio. Of course, technical shit. I didn't start it up. So, man, what is it like living in the UK? That's all right. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's all good. It's fucking, I've lived here my whole life in the UK, really. I've been to Scotland a few times. Oh, shit. What the part UK of Scotland? Is, what up? What part of Scotland? Oh, I couldn't tell you. I've been to Edinburgh before. I've been a few places in Scotland. Oh, yeah. Now, I hear the UK has got a really bad healthcare system there. Is that true? Well, we don't have to pay for a, uh, for a health door. In America, you have to pay for a... Uh, if you get your job work, if you get a broken bone, you have to pay for it in America, don't you? Wow. So you're UK, got... you just get away with it. So it's included in, ta on, I guess you pay taxes? Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's crazy. Canada's like that too near us. America yeah. wouldn't be in so much debt if they did that. 
So how the hell did you come up with Clown Headhunter for your rap name? The name, it was originally The Hunter. My last name's Hunter, okay? Just for your people who don't know, my last name is Hunter, my government name. And it used to be Clown Hunter. Then people start saying, oh, it's the Headhunter, because the way it was acting and shit. It's the Headhunter on the floors, on the tracks. Then it got to adopted the Clown Headhunter. Chat the clown head hunter, get called a few things, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, but yeah, clown head hunter. So, yeah. what got you into making music? Who and who, who inspired you, or what inspired you? I've always loved music all the ages of my life, you know what I'm saying? Since I was like, fucking, since I could masturbate, for you know what I mean? <laughs> I've always loved music, but uh, what inspired us to start making it is just I started just writing thoughts down and shit, you know. Shout out to Jay he helped me uh, get a few contacts and shit and I started rapping. Oh yeah. So, ICP, were they an inspiration? ICP, ICP is a hell of an inspiration for me, dog. Oh, Top yeah. of Holocaust, I like ICP, I like Psycho Sam, I like, you know, I like all the kind of dark, dark side of rap. Like, Go ahead uh, and Bubble and Sean and all them. Go ahead and take a question. I'll pull something up for him. Um, what do you feel um, sets your music apart from other people? My music's just out there, you know what I'm saying? It's like very deep. I've got a deep voice when I'm rapping on the track sometimes. Sometimes it's all so different. Like it's like a, it's a normal voice. So it's it like, is. I think it is different, yeah. It's definitely different. Definitely. I, I could hear you doing horrorcore for sure with the the sound of your voice. The horrorcore shit. Oh yeah. So ICP being your one of your idols, I'll pull this up for you real quick before we take a couple more questions. Show you this. Um. So. Being in the UK, you guys don't have a president. You have the the. Oh, Queen Elizabeth, right? Queen Elizabeth's dead. Well, <laughs> I know. I'm saying like before, Queen Elizabeth, is it the second now? It's the, uh, it's the King Charles, isn't it? Oh, that's, that's right. Now. King Charles is now. Is that the first time there's been a king? It's not the first I, time that has been a king, but it's been the first time a long time. Oh, shit. I don't and really know much a, about the history there. The last time there was a king, there was beheading shit happening all the time. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Last time there was a king was years ago. A long time ago. Before I was born. Damn. So it has been a long time. All right. So I'll pull this up for you. Give you a little peek at this. Oh, very nice. Thanks. What's the name of your program again? Underground Wicked Radio. Underground Wicked Radio. Okay. DJ Snickers, be quiet for one second. All right. Here we go. Underground Wicked Radio in the motherfucking house. Shaggy 2 Dope in this bitch. Big shouts to you and everybody listening. Bam. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. There goes your drop. Are you cool with that? A drop live on the air. That's some crazy shit. A radio station calling a radio station. That's tight. Yeah. Much Word love, up. homies. All right, brother. Hey, All right, man. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Fuck it. I got to send you that. That whole video, bro, was hilarious. Shaggy Tudor was giving me shit about my name the whole time. I got a radio drop from Violent J, too. <coughs> Shaggy Tudor. Fucking awesome. You look like uh, Zug Island? So Island, I've heard of it. He talks about it in his music. Uh, he's like a, more of a rock, Zug Island is. Pretty pretty good band. Um. Damn, man. You believe it. I'm still sick, bro. That's one of the reasons we didn't get out for your interview. It's It's been fucking crazy. I'm still, still fucking <laughs> sick. Yeah, yeah, there she goes. <laughs> what is this stop. food poisoning? I, I'm beginning to wonder if we had corona, man. The way this shit's been hanging on. My voice is still harsh from it. Um, So, how do you go about finding beats for your music? I need to find the right beats, like, uh, you know what I'm saying? I have uh, uh, I have a producer called DJ Sunny Side Up. He's a, he's a very dope producer, by the way. You should check him out. 
and he makes a lot of my beats nowadays. So what does he go by? Sunny Side Up? DJ Sunny Side Up. DJ Sunny Side Up. I'm going to have to check him out for sure. I want to check he out his beats. Beat. Send some artists his way. I know a lot of them. Shout um, smoke. <laughs> so who else in America have you made songs with besides I've Rutgers? made songs with Floyd. I've made songs with Vector. I've made songs with... Uh, I'm not, I'm not going to name them all because some of them I don't like. Like, <laughs> You know what I'm saying? That happens. But I've made songs with... I want to make a song with... Uh, maybe fucking Necro. You know what I'm saying? Oh, hell yeah. Necro's good. Really good. Um, We just had Killy, or, uh, Chloe Kills on. She was doing the float with... Uh, the Tom Wood flow, the connection was really bad, so we got to get her back on for another interview. Uh, what, what we could hear was a pretty good interview. Uh, you listen to any LSP? Who? LSP. LSP? Lyrical Snuff Productions. I don't think I've heard of it, bro. Okay, so video reaction time then. We're going to pull that up after I take another question. I'm getting it ready. Yeah, you got to check them out, and then I'll, I'll send you their YouTube. Um... I'd love to see you do a song with an LSB artist. What <laughs> does your immediate family think of your music? My like my immediate family. My mom do shout to moms. She likes my music. She's about it. Nobody else does, you know what I'm saying? Nobody else approves of it. What do they say about it? They think you're wasting your time or they don't say I'm wasting my time, you just say it's vile all the uh... shit. <laughs> I hear that from a lot of a lot of artists. So I'm going to introduce you to the LSP family, man. These guys are the homies. Uh, we're going to play Armageddon with. So it's a group. LS, uh, Scum and IP do a lot of music together. Scum. Insane poetry. Yeah, he goes by Scum. I've have heard, heard of him, him, yeah. Okay, so you have heard of Scum. LSP is his label that he's got. Um, well, if you heard of him, I'm not going to play a video reaction for that. We'll figure someone else out. Uh, we, actually, we should do um, Kincaid's new video for him. You ever heard of Kincaid? No, no, sir. Okay, well, I'm pulling that out. Are you signed to a label? I was signed to Planet Fleet for a while. And I still am kind of in and off, you know what I'm saying? Bits and bobs. Now, do you prefer to be independent or would you rather be signed? Would I prefer to be by, like independent? Or, or, okay. It depends, really, you know what I'm saying? Like, I like working with people. But it's also like... What benefits it got for me working with people? If the uh, if I'm a good artist and shit, I've got respect for it. But just you know, same old, same old. Depends. Sometimes yeah. I want to be signed. Sometimes I want to be independent. It's got its benefits. Being independent, you can do what you want. But then if you're signed, you kind of have to follow contracts. Yeah. All right. So this is Kincaid's new song. It is called "Killer in My Eyes." Anyone tuning in and listening, go hit that sub button and like button. He made a dope video. Uh, he retired for a while, and he just came back, I want to say, within the last two years. I could be wrong, year to two years. Uh, I'm going to play this for you. I'll get your opinion after the song, and let me know what you think. All right, I'll put my phone I started subtle, but I don't know how to talk. I think about you and I watch you. I love the way that you walk. I don't smell you. I will love the way that you yawn. I love the way you wash your car and how you're cutting your lawn. I love looking in your window at the crack of dawn. I know when your children's home and when you're all alone. Do you love how I sound when I breathe on the phone? I know you love me even more if your husband's gone. I even went and bought this same brand of cologne. 
gone. I even learned all the words to your favorite song. Why you act like you don't see me? Why you drag me alone? I need you to need me and believe we belong. I want to scream when you're speaking, but I need to be strong. Please, why are you keeping me in the zone? I'm sorry when you're speaking. I keep a mean tone. Don't you see that I'm bleeding for the street that you're on? <laughs> I love the way you look at night. I love the way you run at night. I love the way you try and fight. You see the killer in my eyes. I love the way you bleed inside. I love the way you scream and lie. I love the when you try to hide. You see the killer in my eyes. You got a face up with me where your life goes. And now you're in my basement. You can see where the light goes. You see the gleam from the window, but all you see are the light holes. Now you see my eyes gleaming lit up like a light show. And normally I use my bait like I'm psycho. So which is your favorite, the left or the right? So both flavors are my favorite. Now choose where the knife goes. Now on to your nose, the left or the right? I want to keep on fighting and see where this might go. I'll turn your head red when you see where the pipe goes. I'm sorry that you're bleeding. You can't breathe from a light show. Keep on squirming, you gon' freak from the knife holes. It's a pair of carrot that you're walking on tight ropes. You're a bad pair of carrot. Now my hands on your tight throat. I gotta run errands, carrot. You'll survive from the white smoke. I killed Eric Karen. That's him in the white coat. I love the way you look at night. I love the way you run at night. I love the way you try and fight. You see the killer in my eyes. I love the way you bleed inside. I love the way you scream and lie. I love it when you try to hide. You'll see the killer in my eyes. You can run and hide and try to survive. I only wanted to love you. I didn't want you to die. So many times I tried to tell you and I looked in your eyes. But I couldn't speak the words that were on my mind. But you kept playing your games and went on with your lies. Like you couldn't even see me or give me the time. So now I took your eyes and removed your thighs. Now I Lay in the bed and caress your spine. I love the way you look at night. I love the way you run at night. I love the way you try to fight. You see the killer in my eyes. I love the way you bleed inside. I love the way you scream and lie. I love the when you try to hide. You see the killer in my eyes. So what'd you think, homie? I mean, it's all right. He's got a good flow and everything. The video, the video was good. Yeah, better than vi any videos I've made, to be honest. I agree. He he put the him and I believe him and his wife put the music video together. Oh yeah, I'm not the best with music videos because it's like I went out with shit to do. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. So now we need to play one of your songs, homie. Um, what one would you want me to play? Twisted Juggalos on the mic. Actually, I think I heard that. That's a pretty good one. Um, Have you heard it before? I think I did. I was going through a bunch of your songs. That one's not bad at all. Um, take a question while I'm pulling this up. Um, well, if you had to choose one album to listen to for the rest of your life, what would it be? Ooh. Um, that's a hard one. That's a... Uh... I love asking it. One album. All Eyes on Me, Tupac. Nice. Nobody has ever said that one out of all the interviews I've done. All right. What I hope that never happens, you know what I'm saying? Uh, okay, so you said, um, what was the name of the song? My song. The song you're going to play one of mine? Yeah, yeah. Twisted Juggalos on the mic. Spelled like twisted as in like twisted, you know what I'm saying? The group twisted. Let's see, twisted. Let's see, I got the remake, My Addiction. Twisted Juggalos there on the is. mic. Yeah, right here. I was going to say, I've listened to it because it's featuring Wreck Hurst. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
know about scary motherfucker, I keep you wicked A vicious, twisted, sinister, sick, and demon on a mission Tripping on these murderous visions, about to go ballistic So all you little bitches, about to witness next statement In these sex religious bars, I even help out Down with the clown head hunter, we put these six feet in the ground So for sick and hellhounds, I'm still in blood, 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 blood Keep your mouth shut unless you wanna get cut the fuck up Sliced open your stomach and spill them guts I'm big toxic popping Stop it, watch this talk Summon some homies and they'll leave your ass honking Rotting the cold heart of me Spit on fit lunatic talk shit Wait, check this out Seems so you wanna fit in Slip your wrist Guess you can say I'm a suicidal It's sadistic Tipping out some myth Checking out my hate list Need no way to self it at the belly of the beast Increase the disease I'll slap Diablo in the face and shake his feet <laughs> And I'm fit, I'm clean, he's an unsuit No, it's my curse, the curse, worst person on earth I should have been aborted at birth Like, kill the fetus, kill the fetus Mother Earth is pregnant for the third time With interesting rules on the mic The man is in the face and we can't wait from the light And we wonder if you missed it Before we have to save me now And we crave in our presence on the wheel out Call the four dogs of the blue push out Cause we some psychopaths Be it an enemy's and poor buffs And then we'll just fall and sit back and laugh We go around the line, call us some shock Look at your heart, that's in the dark Kill them, cut your face, talk to the demented block We wanna walk the walk, hear the plan I'm on I keep with them, I tell you they ain't spit on my song Cause this doctor man is sick, some misfit shit is double on It's in the belly of the beast, where the fuck I'm from But my never see my voice for all his spirits Should we find a hear it? I'll put your fucking body, watch the warm blood go shout The devil will hear or shout Seeing a proof of the tears I push out This is coming straight from the pits of hell Cover your woman well, four no shotgun shells Blast you to hell, cast you with a spell All I pay to these one of these when they try and pay me The fears of the devil on the cover of my CD It's only the dead that see me This is the devil laughing for God It's me being the most morbid Obsession with death, we want more blood And it won't be ours, let's pay to be all blood Those troubles are crazy and misunderstood As I see a devil sitting in a morbid obsession Bloody run like your motherfucker with weapons Half for you and drop your legs off, nobody will be stepping With interesting troubles on the mic to men and sinners and misfits And we keep away from the light and we wind up So, how long have you been making music, homie? About a year or two. About a year or two? Hell yeah. yeah. How, how old are you? 20. Damn, you're young in the game still. Hell yeah. Yo. So, where would you want to see your career in about five years? Five years. Five years. Where do you want to see your career? I want to sell myself just, you know, I want to save myself, just succeed, do well for myself, you know. I don't care about a million, million dollars, a million views or whatever. Oh, yeah. I just want to be doing well, you know what I mean? So if you ever made it popular, would you ignore your fans that were there from the beginning rooting you on or would you still talk to them? I, I, I got a lot of art artists, man, that have blown up, and now they're just, it's gone to their head. No, bro, I talk to every artist. That's I still have homies, you know what I'm saying? I still talk to them. Oh, yeah. Definitely, man. I try and reach out to as many fans I have every day. That's what I do. That's what's up. That's what it should be. Not let fame go to your head. <sighs> Because you never know, you could go backwards. You could have that fame for a little while, and then it'd just be gone. Yo. So, what do you got? I'm throwing it around the spot. Give me a minute. What up? She's thinking. <coughs> <coughs> what genre of music would you classify yourself as? 
mixed, I'd say. It's sometimes gangster rap, it's sometimes rap music, it's sometimes hardcore. I'd say it's definitely mixed. That's the way to do it. Versatile, different styles. Yeah, yeah. I don't like going and listen to people that sound like the same lyrics and the same monotone voice on one song. Um, damn, I just had a question. Oh, radio drop. We got to get a radio drop from you. So I'm going to have you say this is Clown Headhunter. You're listening to DJ Snickers and DJ Stars on Underground Wicked Radio. And say whatever the fuck you want after that. Go for it. This is Clown Headhunter. You're listening to fucking DJ Snickers and DJ Radio Stars on Underground Wicked Radio. Hell yeah, motherfucker. Say links to where people can find your music. I'll you can find it. my music. Search Clown Headhunter. I'm on all platforms. Oh, yeah. So what's the weather like over there in the UK right now, this time of year? It's normal, you know, like a bit sunny, you know. Hot? Cold? A little bit hot, yeah, a little bit sunny. Is it? Here, we've been in the, God, I want to say 70s, 75, 80s. Um, I think you guys go about Celsius, though, don't you? Every other Instead country in the world but yep. us. <laughs> Degree Celsius. Oh, yeah. Uh, Kim K, the music video you were just watching, Jamie just went and gave you a um, a follow. I'll give it a follow. Cheers, Jamie. Much respect. Um, Yeah, see, I like interviewing artists that just starting out because I like to watch them grow over the years, um, see where their music career goes. So... Have you performed any live shows over there in the UK? Do they have venues for you to? We we'll have venues at some places, but I personally haven't been on stage with them before. No, not yet. Not yet. Now, is that something you want to do in the future? Something I definitely would want to do. I'd be nervous about this, but it being the first time, but oh, something yeah. I want to do. Yeah, I hear you. Messing up and getting everything down right. The backup vocals or the backup beat. It's a lot to get on the stage and perform. Um, oh, sorry, man. This this frick, I'm telling you, I swear to God, we have Corona. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in like a daze. <clears throat> it's, it's been it's been a horrible week. I apologize we missed your interview last week. You're all good, man. I hate doing that shit. To oh. be honest, I would have been asleep. <laughs> I, 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 I believe it. You got it's twelve o'clock over there. I, I appreciate you taking the time and getting on that late. Um, so how do you commit on, or how do you comment on current social media platforms when it comes to promoting yourself? Do you think they help you being on social media, or do you think they'd be better doing it? I think yeah, social media the way things work. I think it does help us get a lot of views over the amount of time I've worked here. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll show you a snickerdoodle easy. Now, I'm telling you, bro, I really think we've had corona. It, it, it's been horrible the last week. Oh, the virus. My fucking shit. They're, they're, Massachusetts isn't too far from us. They just locked that down for a fucking mosquito disease. They're telling people to stay inside, put them in a lockdown. The horse one. Yeah, it's fucked up. Um, all right, so if you could meet any rapper, who would it be and why? Meet any what? Rapper. Any any rapper, underground, mainstream. Who would it be and why? Tupac. I'd want to meet him Just because he's been a main inspiration for me. He, you know, I like his music a lot. And um, but he's dead. I know he's dead. Rest his soul. But right, see him. What's one of your favorite songs by Tupac? Only Caught and Drugs Me. I haven't heard that one in forever. It's a good song. You got a question? Classic. Class, yes, it is. What's your process for coming up with ideas for writing music? It's honestly, it's very hard. To, I just come up with ideas. I just sit there and uh, I sit there and listen to the beat, have the beat on the on rewind over and over again. And I just start writing ideas down. And eventually turn into rhymes and turn into a song. 
See, now I've had a, a few artists tell me that they'll write out the song and then they'll try to find a beat to match that song, which I think would be hard. You think you'd want a beat first? I used to do that. It's not. It's not. I think you need a flow on beat to get it all right. You need a beat first. Yeah. I agree. So you're hitting that marker. You need to know how many words to have in in between a bar. Um. Here, here, here's one I haven't asked in a while. If you could make an ultimate rap song with three artists, who would you pick to be on that song with you? Let me have a think. Uh, let's see, Vinnie G, Shaggy Two Dope, oh, yeah. Neck One. Hell yeah! What's your favorite uh, Necro song? If you have a neck war song, I, I want to see a dead boy disposal. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. So, you, so yes, for you. What, what's your take on Lincoln Park's new singer being a girl? Lincoln Park. Have you seen that? I haven't seen that yet, but, and I don't follow Lincoln Park that much. I've got a couple of the CDs, I must admit. I've got a couple yep. of Lincoln Park CDs, but I can never get into it. Before. They now have a new singer, and she's a girl. People are blasting her because she's under Scientology. I never got into Lincoln Park on. Or <laughs> garbage, huh, Jamie? Oh, but she's... Wait, wait, wait. Oh, hot garbage. I was like, wait, what? <coughs> I don't know, man. I was on a live stream earlier. This guy was blasting her because she was under Scientology and saying that she was... a. Uh, uh, into women, we'll just call that. I can't say the other word because I got banned for it. Okay. So, really, I did not know that. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. Easy. Lincoln Park died with Chester. They, they, they. Sh I, you know, I could see if they started a new band. And called it something else and just left Lincoln Park alone. The name I could understand, but trying to replace him is a big shoes to fill for damn sure. <clears throat> so, what would have, what would be an advice you would give to um, someone just wanting to start out making music? Advice. Yep. I'd see you start writing things down, you know, like what's happening in your life. Well, you, you express your emotions the best you can. And I tell them themselves is the worst critic. Uh, you listen to your own music and you might hear it yourself, but somebody else might like it. You so never know. There's people out there for all kinds of music, man. The fan base, you just got to mm -hmm. find them and keep pushing. Um... <coughs> I don't know if you follow Ren. If I what? Follow Ren. You ever heard of the artist Ren? Not really, no. Oh, shit. Maybe I'll do a video reaction here in a minute. I'll let you listen to Ren. I can't remember where the hell he's from. I, I think he's from the UK. Anyone listening? Uh, Easy or Ken Cage. If you know where Ren from, tell me. Anyways, the guy purchased the beat uh, from... Uh, beat stars and the guy sampled the beat and had it up there he had Ren had to go pull down the beat because the guy sampled it and now he's trying to get money from Ren which is bullshit um I don't know it's all a big mess yeah Ren's from Europe oh no shit no yeah now I gotta show you bro another uh homie from UK all right let me pull up Ren but it, it's a big fucking mess, man. I'm, my personal opinion, I don't think he should pay the guy a dime after getting ripped off. No. I'm not going to say who ripped him off, but we'll just leave it at that. Actually, you know what? Just a big fuck you to the guy. We're going to play the song that got pulled down called Sick Boy because I know yeah, no. people are... are a lot of his fans are posting the video as a big fuck you to the person that got it taken down. All right, so this is Ren, sick boy. Get your opinion. Okay, let me see. Oh, oh, oh. 
All right, we'll be right back after this. <laughs> Thank you for coming in today. Thanks for seeing me. Looking at your file here, it seems there's a very apparent interplay with your emotional state and your physical body. Have you ever heard of the trauma response? Basically, everybody's been stuck with negative feedback. There's a conscious and repeat patterns from the past. It's going to be a pretty drastic downstream effect on our biology. Especially, your mind is moving. Sick boy, sick boy, bitten by a tick boy Looking for that fix boy, anabolic steroids Damn so, post a boy, pass out White noise, quick fix, snake oil I'm about to break boy Oh, what a shame, he's in pain Have another go, take another pill Here, take a couple more Let's see how you're doing in another week or so You'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show Derealization, medical patient Losing patience with the process Walking hand in hand with Satan Complications with the medication Information, dehydration, inhalation Aggravation, building up a toleration Drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown I've been feeling like I'm drowning with my feet upon the ground I've been screaming, I've been shouting But I never make a sound I've been looking for a way out But I always seem to drown Is this all making sense, Ren? Um, yeah, I think so Good what I propose we do is we try to pinpoint the exact experiences from the past that are keeping you stuck. What can you tell me about your childhood? I can't really think. It's okay if nothing comes up right away. What I'd like you to do is take some deep breaths with me. In and out. In and out. Good. Now tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I feel like it's not me. It's the world that's sick. We're given everything we need and we commoditize it. We consume, we destroy like we're parasitic. Science tells us that it's suicide and still we come in. I'm not sick. We are sick. We are standing on a cliff in the name of progress. We jump off the precipice. I'm not sick. I'm the virus. You're the virus, hypocrite. How can you sit there with a smile on and tell me that I'm sick? Sick boy, sick boy, looking for a fix boy. Push it down in public, quick pose for the big boy. Record label me. Things that come on by your gift, boy. Why are you so upset? Don't you wanna be a rich boy? Fuck no, industry is cutthroat. I've been doing bits by myself, swimming backstroke, walking on a tightrope, rapping with a slit throat. The way that we persist is like the ending of a bad joke. As the people of old, we're complacent to assailants and we do what we're told. Counterintelligence, a sight of the whole. Rape the earth of all resources and we plead it for gold. And we plead it for wealth. We bleed it for fame, but when you bleed it, can you tell me what the fuck will remain? And I bleed in myself, I bleed in my brain. While I'm bleeding, I'm the reason, cause I'm doing the same. So what'd you think? Yeah, boy, that was good, that for. His fans are taking that video and uploading it. A big old fuck you to the guy that screwed him over. I think I've seen it before. I think I've seen him before. Hell yeah. Good artist. We need to play more of your music, homie. All right, I'm going to choose one here. Um, Do you have uh, one more that you would like me to play? Hey, bro, my phone's on like 20%, so you can play one if you want. All right. So, giving you a heads up, I'm, I'll only be on for another 20 minutes. Probably gotcha. die on me. Do you want, do you want to play one of, my, one of my songs? Yep, that's where I'm heading now. Uh, which one would you want me to play? Um, fucking feel like a zombie. Oh, that I have heard that one too. I went through and listened to a bunch of your songs. That's a good one. I thought you were gonna say feel like a monster because I heard that one too by you. It wasn't okay. by me. Uh, no, I'm thinking of one of Rectors's old ones. Feel like a zombie. Nope, I did not hear this one. Okay, let the ad play. Lyme disease. Yep, yep.
YouTube's gonna freeze up. All right. What off?
Well, damn. And now OBS is going to be an asshole fucking test. And you know, I swear, every interview, every interview, something happens. I have some kind of... You say it every time. <laughs> every time. Bullshit, <laughs> I don't know. I got some fucking technical that. issues. So, yeah, always, man, it never fails for me. I swear I got bad luck when it comes to tech technology. So before I was hopping off there, or before I got booted, I was asking... Um, uh, what made you decide to write that song? So I like the lyrics on that and the beat. It was pretty good. It was a reflection of me past. I used to be bad on the drugs. You know what I'm saying? It was basically a reflection of me past. Oh, shit. So you used to do drugs? Yeah. And you're clean now? Yeah, I'm clean. Hell yeah, I like to hear that. That's dope. All right. Um, Any shout-outs, homie, that you'd like to do before we hop off? Any shout-outs? Yes. Shout outs to GHG. If you're watching this, shout outs to GHG. Shout outs to fucking. To Rectors. Shout out to Rect. And shout outs to everybody. Keep loving yourself, man. That's it. Hell yeah, man. Thank you for taking the time getting on. I think you're like my seventh artist from the UK I've interviewed. I'd love to get more on if you know anybody there. I don't know any artists. Well, Chrissy B. Ask Chrissy B. Chrissy B. I'll have to check them out. Yeah, All right. UK artist. He might want to jump on. Hell yeah. I'll definitely check him out. All right, homie. You have a good night. Thank you for staying up so late and getting on this interview. Much love, man. Same goes to you, bro. Like, much, much more the fun with the clown. Love you. Keep in touch, homie. Let me know when you drop a new song so I can add you for a video reaction as well. I got you, bro. Whoa, whoa. Whoop, whoop. Have a good night. Underground, Wicked Radio out, Sinister Minded Music Official Radio. Make sure you guys go Google Underground Wicked Radio and tune in, man. I've been working on this freaking playlist for 13 years on my radio for you guys, so check it out. All right, everyone have a good night. Whoop, whoop.